Hi, I'm Ben Frantoni, and today we're at Guildford Castle looking at the difference between prime lenses and zoom lenses. Zoom lenses are lenses which can change the angle of view. You can get wide angle zoom lenses, standard zoom lenses, telephoto zoom lenses, and all encompassing super zoom lenses like this 18 to 200 lens I have here. The advantage to zoom lenses is the flexibility they offer. So potentially being able to bring distant subjects close to you without having to change lens, while they also have the ability to change the sense of depth within the image. Prime lenses are lenses which can't change the angle of view. They're sometimes referred to as fixed focal length lenses, and to get closer or further away from your subject, you have to physically move yourself in the camera. The advantage to prime lenses is that every lens element in the optic is specifically designed for that focal length or angle of view, meaning that generally the image quality should be quite high. Generally, prime lenses offer larger apertures than zoom lenses, meaning they let more light into the camera, giving you better lower light capability and also greater ability to defocus the background. Let's see the difference between taking images with our 50mm f1.8 prime lens and our super zoom lens. Here, we've tried to take the same image with both lenses and offer the same angle of view. This is a super zoom, and you can see it delivers a pleasing result. Using the prime lens, which has a larger aperture, it has greater ability to defocus the background, making the subject stand out even more and offer a really striking image. In this different situation, we've got the super zoom zoomed out to its widest angle, and you can see it can get so much within the image. There's the flowers in the foreground, but also it still manages to incorporate the castle in the background. And all this while still having the capability and versatility to zoom right into the flag at the top of the castle. However, from the same viewpoint, using the 50mm prime lens, we're much more restricted. This is the most we can get in when we aim the camera at the flowers. And pointing it up at the castle, again, you can see that we're quite restricted. So we've seen that zoom lenses offer great flexibility, being suitable for different scenes and situations without having to change lens. Prime lenses offer excellent image quality, but they're more suitable to specific needs and situations. Depending on the type of photography you want to do and how often you want to change lens will determine what type of lens is right for you. If you prefer using prime lenses or zoom lenses, let us know in the comments below. If you want to see more videos like this, click on the icon in the top right hand corner or to subscribe, click on the button below.